United States fights back to beat Great Britain and Ireland. The United States drew first blood in a month of international golf battles, fighting back to defeat Great Britain and Ireland at the 49th Walker Cup on Sunday. Team USA's top men's amateur players had trailed by three points heading into the final day at a windy St. Andrews in Scotland, but roared back to clinch a 14 to 11 victory on the iconic old course. The Americans, captained by Mike McCoy, won three of the four Sunday foursomes and seven of the ten singles matches to claim their fourth consecutive Walker Cup victory and extend their commanding overall record to 39 wins, nine losses and one draw. It's pretty special. It's certainly the pinnacle of my golfing life. McCoy, who suffered a bruising 16 to 9 defeat in his sole Walker Cup playing appearance in 2015, told reporters, 2015 was tough. We felt crummy for our team, felt crummy for the captain. We just got outplayed. This is a great feeling. I tried to put a lot of effort into this for two years and tried to do anything I could that would help make the team successful. I learned a little bit about what made each of them tick, and it just worked out. USA celebrate their victory at the Silken Bridge during day two of the 2023 Walker Cup at SD Andrews. Pictured 8, Sunday, September 3, 2023. 73,588,702. Press Association via AP Images. Team USA poses with the trophy. Robert Perry slash AP. They didn't turn up with their A games. Bleed by strong home support. With over 14,000 spectators in attendance. Stuart Wilson's GB and Ireland team punched above its underdog status from the outset, building a 7 to 4. Saturday led despite the visitors boasting eight of the world's top 10 amateur golfers. At World No. 14. England's John Goff was the host's best-ranked player, a position that would have put him second from bottom on the U.S. roster. The Americans' quality shone through on the deciding day, with Amateur World No. 1 Gordon Sargent and U.S. Amateur Champion Nick Dunlap both playing starring roles. Sargent finished the tournament with a flawless 4-0 record while Dunlap overturned a three-stroke deficit against Barclay Brown to clinch a crucial half-point in the singles matches. 